friends, welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to show you how I customize the frames for my embroidery art. I will link my first punch needle art video at the end of this one so you can see how I use this style of frames that I'm making. I bought these frames from Michaels in a six pack and these are the different tools and materials that I'll be using. I have two different size flat head screwdrivers, needle nose pliers, a stapler, monk's cloth fabric and the frames that I bought from Michaels. Make sure when you're using these tools to be careful. First, I'm going to remove the stock canvas that is on the frame. Here, I'm using the small screwdriver to loosen up the staple. Once the staple is loosened up, I use the needle nose pliers to get the staple out the rest of the way. And I'm going to continue doing this to all the staples on the back. Now that I have taken all the staples out, I'm removing the stock canvas and I'm left with the wooden frame. Next, I'm measuring out a piece of monk's cloth for this frame. And before I cut it, I'm making sure to leave some extra inches of fabric so I can attach it to the back of the frame. I'm going to start at the bottom and I will staple right in the middle and on the sides. Then I'll do the same thing on the opposite side making sure that I'm pulling the fabric tight. I'll do the same process on the right and left side of the frame.
Once I completed attaching all four sides, I added more staples to all sides of the frame, making sure to pull the month's cloth really tight before I staple. To finish, I fold the corners this way. It's really easy and it adds a clean finished look to the canvas. And this is how the customized frame came out. I think it looks great and it's perfect for any embroidery punch needle art. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. I hope you guys liked it and found it helpful. Also, I'm going to leave all the materials that I use in this video in the description box. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos. I'll see you in the next one.